If you've been diagnosed with prostate cancer, you may feel upset, scared, or like things are out of control. Prostate cancer and its treatments can affect every aspect of your life and daily routine. One of the ways you can take back control is to learn about the disease and what you can do. Prostate cancer is the most commonly diagnosed cancer among men in Canada. One in nine Canadian men will be diagnosed with prostate cancer in their lifetime, so you are not alone. In fact, when you receive your diagnosis, you'll be introduced to a team of healthcare professionals who will support you, including your urologist, nurse, and possibly a medical oncologist or radiation oncologist. You and your healthcare team will talk about your diagnosis and the different kinds of treatments. You should be part of the decisions to choose the treatments that are best for you. So what is the prostate? It's part of the male reproductive system. It sits below the bladder and in front of the rectum. The prostate's job is to help form semen by producing fluid that mixes with sperm from the testicles. Prostate cancer happens when normal cells in the prostate grow faster or die more slowly than usual. This leads to a cancerous tumor over time. It helps to know some of the words that your healthcare team will use so you can understand the disease. The grade of your tumor and stage of your disease are important to know and will help you and your team decide which treatment is best. The grade of the tumor refers to how abnormal the tumor cells look under a microscope when compared to normal cells. It tells your doctor how quickly the cancer may be growing and how likely it is to spread. The cancer stage describes how big the tumor is and whether it has spread outside the prostate to other parts of the body. If the tumor is found only in the prostate, it is called localized prostate cancer and it includes both stage 1 and stage 2 disease. Stage 3, or locally advanced prostate cancer, is when the cancer has spread outside of the prostate to nearby areas of the body. Stage 4, or metastatic prostate cancer, is when the cancer has spread to lymph glands or other parts of the body such as bones, liver, or lungs. It's important to know that most early stage prostate cancer can be treated successfully. In some cases, the tumor will grow so slowly it can be monitored with active surveillance which can delay or avoid other treatments. Other types of prostate cancer treatment include surgery, radiation therapy, hormone therapy, which is referred to as androgen deprivation therapy or ADT, and chemotherapy. The treatment you and your healthcare team choose will depend on the stage of your cancer and your overall health. Some of these treatments may cause side effects that can affect your daily life. That's why it is important to think about your lifestyle when you are looking at the different treatments for your disease. At your next appointment with your healthcare team, make sure you tell them what is important to you as you consider the different kinds of treatment. For example, sexual intimacy with your partner may be important to you, so you may decide on a treatment that will have fewer sexual side effects. Don't be afraid to ask your healthcare team for advice. It's also common to get a second opinion if you need help choosing the right treatment for you. Understanding your diagnosis and working with your healthcare team will help you take control of your life with prostate cancer. To learn more about prostate cancer, visit prostatecancer.ca.